Nearly a year after a bitter dispute closed the BOR Peachester RSL Club, it's reopened to applause. The RSL sub-brand says its major focus will be on welfare, serving both veterans and the community. Rain for the reopening can't compare to the obstacles already overcome to make today possible. Chrissy declare the BOR Peachester RSL sub-branch club open. Sub-branch president John Rowan is proud. But with the perseverance and the enthusiasm of literally an army of supporters, volunteers and our wonderful staff, we have achieved what many would have said was impossible. Last April, the sub-branch closed the BOR Peachester RSL Club after a bitter dispute with management. Which was not pleasant for us as a, a community and a region, but ultimately the club has bounced back. Karen Inglis and Cathy Elliott were among 30 staff who were laid off. They're happy to have their jobs back. I think the atmosphere is a lot yeah. better, it's not stressful. And a lot of the old members that are back are really happy. Hard-working members volunteered hundreds of hours towards the renovations. This is such an amazing transformation. It's great. Profits will fund the Veterans Drop-In and Welfare Centre and other community causes. Welfare is the core of uh, uh, returned servicemen sub-branches. Founding sub-branch member and Changi prisoner of war survivor Neville Anning is impressed. We have never had... Uh, at happier than it is now. Jennifer Nichols, 7 News.